Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, your pet ass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Unova Red walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we got to the Pokemon Mansion and defeated everybody in there, mostly everybody, and got ourselves a secret key in order to go to the Cinnabar Island Gym. Now, before we go anywhere, let's go in here, Pokemon Lab, because we kind of need to do something. Now, this is something that I always skip over. I don't know why, but right here, a photo of the lab founder, Dr. Fuji. I never, ever, ever got gotten to check this thing out. Never looked at it until I was playing, I think, Pokemon Fire Red, I think? I don't know. But that right there just surprised me just, just as much. Now, here we are. Let's see. Hello, trainer. Do you want to trade your Zeb Striker for an electric? No, thank you. Let's see. Found this a very strange fossil at Mount Moon. I think it's a rare prehistoric Pokemon. That's good. And let's see. Do you have a Carablast? Do you want to trade it for a Shellmint? Now, there are two play like, I think this is the second person that will trade you the other Pokemon and vice versa and whatnot, so I'm going to go back to him once we actually, you know, get everything taken, taken care of now. Let's see, some Pokemon evolved, level, yeah, whatever. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk to this guy, tick, tick, tick. I made the cool TM, I can, uh, ha I can cause all kinds of fun, and here we have the TM35 metronome, which of course is metronome. Well, yeah, I already said that twice, wow. And, well, let's go right ahead and talk to this man right here. Hiya! I'm an important doctor. I study here rare Pokemon fossils. You, you, have you a fossil for me? Yes, I have the plume fossil. And this will actually get a an Arcana revive, so we're gonna go ahead and give him that, and it, it'll take a little bit of time. Go for a walk for a little bit, okay? So let's go for a walk and then get this Arcan right here. Get the Arcan, okay? And of course, my repel has worn off because I don't know. I really don't know. So here we go, going back in, going back out, giggity, and well, let's go right ahead and see what it's all about. <laughs> Right here, and he's like, where were you? Your fossil is back to life. It was an Arcan, I think. Oh, damn. And, well, let's not give it a nickname. And take a look at this new Pokemon that we have right here, Arcan. Look at this. The rock and flying type Pokemon. It is very, very fast. It's much more of a physical attacker than anything. And it already has some pretty nice attacks. You know, wing attack, double team, rock throw, agility, and all that crud. One good fossil Pokemon, and well, let's see, I'm looking for a Darumaka. Want to trade it for a Kubchu? I think I've already gotten a Darumaka. I don't know. I think so. So that right there is that with the whole uh, fossil Pokemon and all that stuff. Now, it is time for us to go and take on the gym leader. Now, I'm not intending to face uh, every single trainer in that place. So we're going to be grabbing some legendary Pokemon because, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. Okay, so... Say goodbye to Heat more. And let's see. Arkin is another Pokemon I do not need right now. Let's see. Gigalift. Definitely another Pokemon that I don't need. And let's go ahead and withdraw a Pokemon strong enough to defeat this guy. Let's see. Hmm. Let's see. Well, Golit, we can actually use it, but look at that. We got three legendary Pokemon ready to just kick some butt, take some names, and all that crud too. Is it like cheating? Maybe, maybe, but you know what? Playing to win, homie. Playing to win. All right, let's go ahead and grab this. And, oh wow, I didn't want a Basculin. Uh, let's deposit that. And put this, put Basculin back. And let's go back to the restaurant. Okay. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and start healing our Pokemon. I know people are judging me and all that stuff. Why are you using legendary Pokemon to, to actually beat these gym leaders? Well, it's a hat game. It pretty much is a hat game. So, you know, we could do what we want right here. And, well, here we are in the seventh badge, the seventh gym battle, or seventh gym. And here's the Pokemon quiz. And, yes, okay, get it wrong. Place the trainer if you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader. Then get it right. Siwaddle evolves into Levani. Yes, it does. Okay. Hopefully, I don't mess up on any of these things right here. Siwaddle and Levani. Okay, you guys are... Well, I've already defeated you guys. And Pokemon quiz. Get it right. Door opens. Next room. Get it wrong. Get the room. Alrighty. 
Let's see, there are nine certified Pokemon League badges. New! Now, if you were playing Pokemon Gold and Silver, it's 16! But not right now. Alright, here we go. Right here. Pokemon quiz, get it right, door opens, da 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 da. Okay, and. Let's see, get it right. Time pull evolves three times. No, it doesn't. It does not evolve three times. Okay. Let us move on. Takes a while just for just for everything to load right here. So here we go. Pokemon quiz, the same thing. Da 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 da. And well, let's see, get it right and go. Are thunder moves effective against ground element type Pokemon? No. If they were, this would be so much easier, guys. So so much easier. Okay, so let's go right ahead and stay on top right here. Pokemon quiz. We're doing the same thing. Da 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 da. And let's see. Pokemon of the same kind are not identical. Yes, that's right. They are not identical. So you may have two Raditas at level five with same HP. They will grow up differently, guys. Trust me on that one. And what? Well, let's see. Hmm. Get it right. Get it wrong. No. Do do do. And let's see. TM28 contains Tombstoner. No, it doesn't. Even if it doesn't, I want to know what it is. Okay, so that, I think, is the last quiz right there. So let's go right ahead and pick out a good Pokemon. You know what? Killer Croc is a good Pokemon to actually have right here. So let's go right ahead and battle this guy. Ha! I am Blaine. I am the leader of the Cinnabar Gym. My fiery Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. Ha! You better bring Burn Hill. Alrighty. Alrighty. I love this song. Here it is, guys. Gym battle number seven against Blaine himself. And let's see what kind of a... Uh, well, look at that. Look at this. This guy looks like a Super Saiyan 3. Too bad it's about to get a Super Saiyan 3 kind of ass whooping. And, well, look at this. Oh, look at that. Earthquake attack. And the Earthquake does it. So it might look like that I might not need my other Pokemon right here. And, well, he's about to come out with a heat more. Let's continue on with Killer Croc. Ah, kill a croc, earthquake attack for the win. Kill a croc does it. Look at that. Okay, he more has been defeated. Okay, alrighty. And well, he's coming out with a Darmat Darmatan. And well, look at this guy. He looks all crazy. He looks like he's been hopped up on energy drinks and stuff. And Darmatan. Not looking like the Pokemon that we thought it would be because Earthquake Attack does it again. Kill the Croc taking all the experience points. And here we have one more Pokemon of Volcarona. Let's go ahead and switch out to Zekrom right here. Volcarona is a Pokemon. It's a, I want to say it's a pseudo legendary, but then again, it's a legendary because it does evolve. So let's go with a Thunderbolt. Volcarona. Nearly defeated, and well, here comes a super potion, wasting up a move right here. So let's go again. Thunderbolt again. Look at that. Oh, oh wow. Doesn't defeat it, and here comes the bug bite. And that doesn't do anything. Okay, slash attack. Hmm. Slash attack does it, and here comes the quiver dance. Now, that's one of its most powerful moves. The hell? And its speed has risen. And. I don't know what you're doing, but that right there is scary. That is a scary move, and well, too late. There we go. Slash attack does it, and Blaine is no more. I have burnt out! You have earned the Volcano Badge. Mm hmm. Ha! The Volcano Badge heightens the special abilities of your Pokemon. Here, you can have this too. And we get ourselves the TM38, which is Fire Blast. Teach it to a Fire type. Darmanitan or Heatmore would be the best spats. And let's see, Fire Blast is the ultimate fire technique. Don't waste it on a water Pokemon. Okay, we won't. We will, actually, we will, because we don't follow directions properly right here. And well, that is seven badges in all, guys. I say we're getting close to actually getting to the very end of this whole walkthrough, but then again, I don't know, because, uh, yeah. This game just keeps me surprised every single time. So, there it is, guys. We have won our seventh badge, and now it is time for us to actually go back to Viridian City to get our eighth badge and see who 
we're going to be facing in the Elite Four. So thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys for another episode of Pokemon Unova Red. See you guys. Thank you.